How's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to boost your FPS on Arsenal. Anyways, let's hop right into the video. Cut her off, it was painless. Show me fate, love, it was shameless. I should have known that we would never make it. Okay, so first of all, you guys want to do is head over to your Roblox settings. Go down to graphics quality. Make sure you have graphics quality auto turned off. You can tell if it's um turned on. That means it's on auto, but you want to turn it off. And then it's going to show you the manual. So I recommend you guys just turn all this off. Graphics quality one. And yeah. So now what you guys want to do is head over to your settings in um in the game. And what you guys want to do is probably change your FOV. Um, this is also like a setting. I recommend either 80 or 84 between that, um, or something higher than that, but definitely not 100. I don't know. I, I'm just gonna uh, um, do 80, I prefer that, but yeah. Now we're gonna have it head over to our graphics settings, and you want to turn off shadows, basic skins, particle physics, and viewport character. Now you head, head over to your audio and make sure micro megaphones are off because let me tell you, if you play Arsenal, you definitely know what I'm talking about. You also want to um, turn this on, mute copyrighted audio, or music, sorry. And now you want to you wanna head over to um, your input. Make sure you have auto reloading off. So then um, this doesn't happen to you. So let me show you, for example, if you have um, auto reloading on let me show you so if you shoot look you see so um i turned off the volume because i'm um, you know i was doing a youtube video which i'm doing right now so that's why you can't hear any sound but look let me show you see it's going to reload every time so that's what you guys want to do just turn off um auto reload and just do it manually it's going to help you so what you guys want to do next is head over to your task manager if you guys don't know how to do that um, you can either right click on your taskbar and hit task manager or you can um, what you can um, do as well is hit control shift escape on your keyboard and now it shows you um, your task manager so I'm gonna I'm um, just quickly open up Roblox um, the Roblox player just because um, you know just to um, head over into Roblox Game Client. So you're gonna open that, right click on it, and hit go to details. As you can see, it shows Roblox Player Beta.exe. I'm gonna right click that, hit set affinity, and you wanna hit all th um, these, um, all these boxes. You just wanna tick all of them, or you can just simply just um, click this, yeah, and you wanna hit OK. Now what's that going to do is that it's going to um, tell all your CPUs to, um, to work on this and it's going to run way more faster. What else you could do is head over to um, details, um, set um, priority, sorry. Um, and what you guys want to do is um, if it's below normal or low, just set it to normal. I don't recommend hitting any of these settings above normal. It's up to you, but I highly recommend not to hit any of these settings. Unless you really have to. Anyways, what we're gonna do now is exit out of um, Task Manager, right click on the Roblox Play shortcut, and hit Open File Location. Now, what we're gonna do is head over to Platform Content, open that up, open PC, open Textures, and what's that gonna do? What's that? Is going to do is show you a bunch of file um, folders which it is going to contain all the textures for example it can show you like the bricks in the game the concrete all that but you do not want to um, delete any of these that's what I'm going to be talking about so what we're going to do is we're going to um, highlight all of these folders um, except um, these three at the bottom after just images and I highly, like that, no, actually do not delete those, definitely, 100%. So you're gonna right click on that and delete. Now that doesn't really affect me, but um, I highly recommend you guys do that if you guys are struggling with um, FPS 
and you just want to boost it, you know, get better gameplay for either doing it for a montage, a YouTube video, or just gaming in general, really. So, that's what you guys are going to do. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope this helped you out. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I will see you in the next video. See ya.